Why, Rapunzel, look at you, as fragile as a flower, just a little sapling, just a sprout. You know why we stay up in this tower. I know. That's right, to keep you safe and sound, dear. Guess I always knew this day was coming. Knew that soon you'd want to leave the nest. Soon, but not yet. But shh, trust me, pet. Mother knows best. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm the lost princess. What's that? The smaller. I'm Mother Gothel. I'm Rapunzel. And I'm Flynn Rider. I've done my channel for a year, and a lot of you guys wanted to see this look. If you want to see how to get this look, keep on watching. Let Let's us get, get on, on to, to the, the video. video. Woo, 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 woo! Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have Kaysen and, and my mom. Uh-huh. Hi. Hi. Should we get started, guys? Yeah. Yeah. I've been dying to start it. So for Kaysen, we're just going to start by adding some sideburns on the sides of his Ooh. hair and then some eyebrows and his goatee. So for Kaysen, um, we're just going to use some brown face paint to kind of make his sideburns. I'm using Best Year Ever. And I'm using Sleigh Bells. Will you marry me? And Christmas Dream on my lid to kind of make it this color. All I'm doing is doing a pink on my lid and a light brown on my crease. You might use some eyebrow pencil and just color it in brown. So we're gonna use the Brow Pro palette. And we're gonna use some dark colors to kind of make Jason's hair look darker. We all already have our foundation on. Kaysen has his foundation on, I have my foundation on, and my mom has her foundation on. You don't have to do foundation if you're just dressing up at home. We like to do it because it looks good on camera. If you want to do it, you can, but you don't have to. Nope. 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 <laughs> so to make it even on this side, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to layer the face paint first, and then we're going to do the brow powder on top. We want Rapunzel's eyes to be really big and round. I'm using the Jaclyn Hill palette. And I'm using this color right here. Right. Now we're gonna use dark brown from the Perfect Arch Soft Brow Powder pencil. We're gonna draw on his sideburns. Now I'm gonna do my blush. I'm using Will You Marry Me. Now we're gonna do his eyebrows and his goatee. Now I'm gonna do some mascara. Some of this brow gel to curl my back. Just slick them down so we can draw. And I'm just doing little hairline strokes. Hey, bud, how's that? <laughs> Looking pretty good, dude. Am I done? Almost. We're just gonna give you just a teeny bit of blush. blush. This is Milani Rose. <laughs> Mommy, can Rose I put the 
Mommy, can I put it on me? Sure. Just smile and put it right on the apple. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And the other side. Okay. My look is done. Looks pretty good. So he's gonna go out while we finish up Daya and I finish up my makeup. Now we're gonna do my brows. So we're using the same palette. For Kaysen we used medium brown. For Daya we're gonna be using blonde and taupe. So Rapunzel has pretty skinny eyebrows so we're gonna make them pretty skinny. <laughs> Now I'm done with my eyebrows, and I'm gonna do this highbrow in my waterline. Well, for Mother Gothel, she kind of only has a little bit of brown in the crease, so we're not gonna do a whole lot. I did foundation, but I didn't set my face yet, so I'm just gonna use the Charlotte Tilbury powder. Yeah, that just makes her eyes look really open and like bigger, which Rapunzel has really big brown eyes. So. <laughs> I'm using the Lorac Pro palette and I'm gonna use the color taupe in my crease. I want my eyes to look really hollowed out. I'm gonna add a little bit of sable in the crease some more just to darken it up. So I'm going to add that under the eye as well. I'll help Daya do her freckles really quick. So we're just using the Perfect Arch Soft Powder Brow Pencil. This one is in the color Auburn. And all I'm doing is pressing and twist. Press and twist. Press and twist. Now I'm gonna do these two colors. Now I am going to do some black eyeliner in my waterline. This is the Makeup Forever Aqua XL pencil. It's mine. So I'm just gonna hurry and finish up my makeup and then we'll show you the final look all together. I'm just finishing by putting this um, black liner under my eyes. Now we're gonna take an angled brush and just kind of smudge that out so it gives it kind of a smoky look a little bit. So for her eyebrows, we're gonna keep them pretty skinny. We're going to use like this ebony and maybe this granite color. We're gonna keep them really dark because Mother Gothel has really dark eyebrows. And I like that. Now let's do the other one. Okay, so my brows are done. Now I just want to um, kind of darken up my crease just a little bit more. So I am going to use a fluffy brush. I'm gonna use the color espresso and maybe a little bit of black. Like a dark brown and a dark black. Now I'm going to add some contour. I'm gonna use this kit from Profusion. It's $7 at Target, so it's a really good deal. But I'm just gonna create some high cheekbones. I'm gonna use this cream color to go all over my lid. I'm gonna add a little bit of blush. This is the Rose d'Oro from Milani. Really pretty color. And I'm gonna contour my nose just a little bit. Okay, now for the lips. I'm gonna use this Rimmel lip liner. It's just like a mauvey reddish color. Now I'm gonna add this Ulta lipstick in the color Petal. 
to make it a little more red, I'm gonna add Red Revival from Maybelline. And I just wanna deepen up the corners, so I'm gonna add a little bit of black eyeshadow. See how it just deepens it up and makes it look a little bit darker? Mother Gothel, she is youthful when she uses Rapunzel's hair, but she does have a little bit of wrinkles because she's still a little bit old. So we're gonna add a little bit of wrinkles. We're gonna add some like smile lines here. And all you have to do is take a brown eyeshadow and kind of follow where your natural lines would be. See how it just ages you a little bit? I'm gonna do a couple kind of under the eye. I know where if I smile, you see the lines when I smile. And then I just want to soften everything because I want her to still look a little bit youthful. So just with your finger, you're just going to tap it out a little bit. I already have false lashes. They're just eyelash extensions on my eyelashes. So I'm just going to add a little mascara to the bottom. Okay, I'm gonna go get the kids. Ooh, I'm gonna add a little of this gloss first. Just a red gloss. I'm gonna go get the kids. We'll get our wigs on and we'll be right back. Here's the final look, guys. Yeah. guys like this look. Who's your favorite character in Tangled? I would have to say Mother Gothel, of course. Rapunzel? <gasps> Not me? No. Who's yours? My, uh, Mother Gothel. Yeah! Blue Rider. <laughs> Give us a big thumbs up, guys. A big one, double. And subscribe, 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 subscribe. Subscribing helps me so much, it helps support us. Definitely do it. Yeah.